Hey, welcome back. This Wednesday, some of the best women's gymnastics teams are tumbling into Norman for the NCAA Regionals. Seven of the nine teams competing are actually ranked in the top 25. Ooh. And leading the pack, number one, the University of Oklahoma. That's where our Jordan Daphnis is this morning, giving us a preview for the big meet. Jordan, come on, what's going on? Oh, you guys, this is so exciting, especially for all Oklahomans, that you have the opportunity to come and watch such talented gymnasts right in your backyard. This is the NCAA Women's Gymnastics Norman Regional. And I've got Coach KJ Kindler here to talk a little bit about what your expectations are for your team. They're seated, number one. They're incredible girls, incredible athletes. What do you expect going into this competition? Well, as a coach, you're always hoping that you can contend to be in that final night, semifinals and finals in Fort Worth. So qualifying for that means we'd finish in the top two in this regional. Wow. And going into every tournament, you've got to have a mindset of focus and determination. How do you prep your girls before each meet? Oh gosh, there's so many different things we have to do to motivate them. First of all, we have to make sure they feel great physically and then of course mentally. You know, gymnastics is a very mental sport, just like many are. We're watching the final four, we're watching basketball and all those low seas going out. So it's really important that their mental game is, is on key. What are some of the skills that people will see when they come out and they watch these girls? Oh gosh, you're gonna see some really amazing gymnastics. They're powerful, they're graceful. Um, they are the premium athlete. Like they have to be strong from head to toe and they entertain. I'm telling you, if you come and watch, you will not be disappointed. Amazing. Okay, we've got Ali Stern here. Ali Stern is a vaulter. Is that right? Do I say vaulter? Is yeah. that correct? Okay, I'm like still learning my terminology here. Ali, you're an incredible athlete and you've got five years under your belt. You got a perfect 10 last year. Tell us a little bit about what you do when you perform vault. Well, vault is a really quick event, so a lot goes into it than you see but mostly just setting everything up for the perfect block off the table and a good landing. Allie, what kind of preparation goes into preparing for this? Like you said, it happens really fast, this quick but very important skill. We do a lot of numbers in the gym, but mostly quality numbers, not um, for quantity to get those all those details right. Awesome, okay, being a leader on this team, you're a, this is your fifth year and you're helping these younger girls. What are you telling them when they go and they prepare for a meet like this? Just to be confident and do their gymnastics. They do it perfect in the gym all the time. So just to come out here should be no different and even more fun out here. You know, I'm curious, what is the hardest part of going into your competition or each competition? Um, kind of just trying to block out all of the distractions and all of the um, loudness and just to tune into yourself and your gymnastics. Incredible. Well, KJ, yes. we have the opportunity to create a home team advantage during this tournament. When can people come out and why should they? Well, first of all, as the host of the event, that's the big advantage we have is we have our Sooner fans. And so we want this place absolutely filled. And this year we've had our highest attendance of any year in the history of the program. We have filled this place up. So we want to see that again. We compete on Thursday night at 7. We compete again on Saturday if we qualify on at 5 p.m. There's also an afternoon session on Thursday. Fans can come see teams from all over the country and they're incredible. Awesome. Thank you so much, KJ. A great thing to take the kids to also so they can see just so much athleticism. These tickets are inexpensive as well. We have the link to purchase on the News 9 app. Live this morning, Jordan Daphnis, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.